Okay, here we are my friends. I want to teach you how you can check the timing chain stretch in a Mercedes. This is a 1996 250D. It's a diesel engine. It's a five cylinders. As you see, is the OM605. So in the upper part of the motor, of the engine, as you see, I remove the cover and it seems on the cam lobes there isn't any kind of damage or stretches or something that I can see with my eyes or feeling with my uh, hand. There is no kind of damage, okay? And another thing that I check is the tapping, okay? All of them seems to work fine because I try to put a piece of paper, a piece of uh, plastic, sorry, and uh, they offer a great amount of resistance so you cannot move freely you need to push very hard and this is common for all of them so i suppose all the tappets are working very fine and all the cam slob are in a very good condition but the next check is the timing stretch so as you see you need a 27 millimeters sockets okay so you need to rotate the engine very important only rotate clockwise at the point in which as you see here you can align this hole okay with the hole that is on the back so just to give you an idea at this point you can easily put a nut okay in this hole in this way this is a six millimeter or you can use for example uh, a drill or a point um, or something like that after that you need to check, I'll let you show you now in a moment, on this side of the motor, of the engine, okay, the amount of degrees after the zero. Okay, it's not easy, unfortunately, for the camera, but you see there is a zero, okay, that is the top, uh, the first, uh, cylinder number one, top dead center, and in this case, unfortunately, in my engine, there are five degrees of uh, difference. So it means that this change has a, a certain amount of stretch. Uh, usually Mercedes don't consider something more than five degrees. So in that case, simply you need to change the timing change. In the case of this engine, unfortunately, the situation is not so good. In fact, I was uh, experimenting some noise in the engine, and in particular at uh, 800 uh, rev, uh, it was very uh, grungling, grung, grung, grung. So it means there is something wrong. It could be that the timing stretch is uh, too much, okay? At five degrees, we need to consider to change the time, the timing chain, but it really depends from the amount of time and money that they want to spend in this money, in this car. Okay, see you soon. Bye.